Hey y'all, this is Tennessee Jeff here with his step kids. Uh, I just thought I'd, uh, you know, take them out snowing, you know, just to, it's the first snow day of school. I just got off work. I haven't been to sleep, but I mean, hey, I found these two plastic pieces, so I thought, why not give it a try? <laughs> <laughs> Amen. Yeah, I'm ready. I think she's making fun of my country talking. And yeah, I'm going to put this on YouTube. See y'all, you hear? I'm finally back with uh, another signal. We've been digging a lot of nails, and he's trying to learn the F-75. And uh, Doug down kind of got an iffy signal, but I went ahead and dug. It's a 69 caliber brown ball. Uh, I don't know if it's... Oh, that's... I don't know if it's been fired. Yeah, it's been fired. Alrighty, I'll we'll be back. Okay, I'm back out of here at what I thought was a home site. I talked to the landowner a little bit more about it, and he said uh, he thinks it was an old uh, well that it was dug back in the day when uh, this was uh, actually Avery, Tr Avery Trace, and uh, everybody just kind of stopped by and got water on the way to wherever they were going. But uh, I'm using uh, AT Gold today, uh, Chambo Relic. He was nice enough to let me borrow it for a a little bit. I brought it. I was gonna bring it out here at that small coil and see what uh, I could find. I've went in the main part of it where I was finding a lot of buttons and uh, coins and stuff, and really never picked up anything different. I mean, it's gonna take me a little bit to get used to it. It's uh, quite a bit different than the AT Pro, but I've got a uh, 70 reading at 75, 76. I just got it out of the ground. Uh, it's over in this clod right here, right in here, and I was gonna see what it was. I thought I'd turn the camera on just in case it was something real good. Let's see. Oh, yeah, that's one of them good 12th Georges. Alrighty, I'll get off here. Alright, I come out of the woods. Uh, I'm going to come out here and try to find some Civil War relics, but uh, anyway, uh, Swap to the uh, beast over here and first signal. Deep high tone. It was, I don't know if it was rolling back in a hole or what, but I had to dig a deep hole to get it. But I got it. All right, hopefully I'll be back. All right, I've been digging a piece of camp lead here, here and there, and another pistol bullet. But got a neat little target right here. It's a real small piece of brass. It's a like a cuff link. Pretty sure that's what it is. Still got the shank. But, uh, I guess it's. A, I don't know how they connected. I guess it's a shank. Looks like it's bent over. Anyway, uh, I'll be back. All right, it's Tennessee Jeff. Uh, I'm back with the day's finds. Uh, of course, my stepdaughter. She's in a bad mood. Evidently. Uh, her sister-in-law is wearing one of her yeah! shirts that she bought herself and no! doesn't like it. But anyway, the finds for the weekend. Okay, I've got a, ended up with a Spencer uh, cartridge. That was pretty good. Uh, of course, it hadn't been fired. I guess they pulled a bullet out of it to start a fire. Found a, uh, I think it's probably a 32 caliber. It's got three rings on it. Uh, Part of the uh, cartridge is still with it, just the tip of it. Uh, 169 round ball. Uh, a few pieces of camp lead. Several, uh, like 32, 31 caliber uh, pistol bullets. One, one or two fired pistol bullets. Uh, here's a thimble. Uh, of course, it's seen its better days. I mean, but it is what it is. Found a uh, cuff link. Doesn't have anything on the front. Just smooth. Found another Tomback cuff button. That was pretty good find. 
uh, found another button. Really don't know what, it doesn't have anything on it. Really don't know what kind it is. It's got a kind of a funny shank. Uh, found a rivet, uh, a couple of uh, horse tack buckles, I'd say. I don't know if it's horse tack. I'm pretty sure it is. Found this little piece. Don't know what it is. Anybody's got any ideas? Looked like it went on a stick or a piece of wood. Uh, get it in the light a little bit. But if anybody can tell, has any idea what it is, just please leave a comment. Uh, found a tip to a file. Uh, then found, uh, I don't know if these two go together. They was pretty close together, but uh, of course you can tell that was the old, uh, I call them old butter knives. It was, uh, had the bent tip on them. And then here was another one I found. It was a some kind of knife. And then, uh, I guess the find for the weekend was this, I don't, I say it was a knife handle. I don't know if it's a fork, spoon, or just a knife handle, but I mean, it was real, I mean, it's made real, real, real well. Doesn't have any maker marks on it. Of course, I'm sure that it was on the blade. It is, uh, it is bone. Of course, you've got pewter here, and then the rings are pewter computer on the tips but yeah that's that's a beautiful handle I, just, I wished I had the whole thing but anyway that was the weekend finds and uh, thanks for watching happy hunting and God bless <laughs>